In this video, I'm going to show you the media library and how to use it. You'll find it right here at the top of the sidebar, media library. We click, and by default, we're taken to the My Media folder. This is where you'll save all of your own files. By default, we give you a couple folders, images, videos. There's a My AI Images and a My AI Videos. This is the default location for all the AI videos that you create. It'll automatically put your generated content there. You can also create your own folders. To help organize things. So you can come into here. See my images. I can sort it by name, oldest, newest. If I double click on a file, I can see a preview. You can also right click on it, again preview, redesign it. This will be, bring it back into the AI editor. So this was generated by AI. Recall the same prompt so I can create another variation of it. I can rename it. I can move it to another folder. I can download it and I can delete it. Now to use files from our library, we simply click, drag and hold and we'll bring it down to our timeline, just like this. Let's go back, Let's look at some of these other sections. So we have stock, either images or videos. So this is gonna be stock media. It's gonna go out and search the internet for royalty-free content. So if I search for duck, I get a bunch of duck images, which again, I can preview and put on my timeline. There's also videos, search, drag this down in our timeline. And then finally, we have three folders, video, audio, and images. These are things that we've added that you can use royalty-free. They're all organized here. So we have backgrounds that you can use, people, we also have audio, ambient sounds, sound effects, background music. Drag it down to the timeline. And finally, images, abstract images, people. You can search the library for something specific, and you can also expand it out, make it full screen, make it easier to browse and close it when you're done. And that's it. Thanks for watching.